So this is a little rough, but I've made braces for my luggage rack. You know, I also, I, it's an Outback Motor Tech and it failed right here um, because everything past this is bouncing around in the wind. Um, I got a whole other video on putting this piece of metal in because I put that piece in myself. Um, there's also a piece of solid rod in here, but that's a different video. What I built today is this support. So there is zero flex in the luggage rack now. It is a solid piece attached to the frame. So if anything fails now, it's going to be the whole rearward portion of the bike where the passenger weight should be. So if, if it fails now, I'm going to say this bike is not rated for a passenger because the stress here is going onto the seating area of the pa where the passenger would be and this rod well not rod square tube whatever puts weight into the passenger foot peg mounts so this is a blaze saddlebag bracket um, sw motec makes it i made it work with that that's where these bolts and these spacers came from but if you want to do this yourself you'll just need longer bolts and some spacers but it'll work with my saddlebags. It's real high up to the fender. Uh, there'll be no tire issues because you can see it's outside of the inner fender cutouts for the tire. Um, it's the, the, the eye on the end of this might be a little overkill, but I had them laying around from when I built sidecars. So I put that in there just so I had perfect adjustability to where I need it to be. Um, yeah, I could have put a plate on here like I did down there and weld this to the plate while it's on the bike but I hate doing that because everything has a circuit board in it now including my tail light and I'm just worried I'm gonna fry something so I haven't done any welding on the bike this has all been off bike welding so stress goes there if it tries to bend this way which is what broke it stress goes to the foot peg mounts so I sat on this, I yanked around on it, lifted the bike up into the air with it. That is solid. That's not going anywhere. So now I need to mirror that for the left side and then take them off and paint them and put it all back together. Mm -hmm. 